winning is always a motivation. I mean, um, if you win, then it becomes it becomes automatic that uh, uh, the same win uh, makes you think or feel like you'll win the next one. So it's always motivating to win. Yes, um, uh, this is a marathon. Remember, we still have about uh, 25 games to play. We need to forget about that one and then concentrate on the next one, work hard for the next, for the next game. But um, winning the first game and winning against a team that uh, we all think uh, always competes for honors in this country also puts pressure on the boys to perform well in their next game. So I think uh, uh, it was a good start, a good start that, uh, that will that will also put pressure on the boys and us to try and perform better in the next game. But uh, like I said, it's one game at a time. We have forgotten about the first game. We'll take the positives. Uh, we'll also have a critical look at um, the negatives where we went wrong, try to improve. That is the game of football. I think uh, it's, uh, it's still not different from the first game. I mean, LDF is one team that played very well last season. Um, uh, they showed that uh, they, are, they are building a team that will also compete uh, for, for, for honors this season. It's not going to be an easy game. It even becomes more difficult, but uh, it, it will be an interesting game. Uh, two teams that have won their first games, uh, two teams that have history between them. Um, I think it will be a very interesting game. It will be, I think it has always been a game of goals. Um, uh, we hope uh, for the supporters and everybody there will be goals. It's not going to be easy like, like the first one. Uh, uh, but uh, let's see how we'll prepare for that game and uh, wait for, for Saturday. Um, it's always good to score goals. Um, I think uh, it was a bit difficult for them to uh, get into our box. Um, we defended well. Um, uh, I, I think uh, when we... we went for our breaks, which was the plan. I think we did it well. Um, we could have scored more. Uh, we could have still considered more. I think, uh, I think a lot of, a lot, there's there are a number of good signs. Like I said, we defended well. I think the moments that we had to score goals were also good. We just need to improve on small aspects of the game to become a better team. It becomes a good signing. I mean, if you sign a striker and he starts scoring goals, then it's a good thing. Uh, everybody becomes happy. Um, uh, we we have a couple of strikers in our team, and those that we believe can give us goals. Uh, we are not going to put any pressure on him. Um, we don't want uh, we don't want him to only become our I mean, we don't want him to become our only goal scorer. We 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 believe that uh, all the strikers that we have will will give us goals this season. So uh, it's a good acquisition. I think uh, uh, we are happy with uh, what he gave. Um, we can't expect more. I mean, one official game, one goal. It's a good signing. It uh, it proves to be a a good signing. Not putting any pressure on him. I'm happy. It's a good start. Uh, um, it's. Um, I think everybody dreams uh, to have a good start in any institution, in any kind of work. So, uh, I feel I feel happy. And the boys did us proud. They worked hard, and uh, I think at least. Everybody will settle. Um, we need to manage complacency now. Uh, we need to know that uh, this is a race. One game has gone. We are left with 25. Uh, that is what we should look forward to. Take the positives from the first game. Build on those positives. Um, critically look at uh, where we went 
wrong or where we didn't do things the way that we would expect and then build on on the same thing this is this it's going to be a long process it's going to be a long process you always learn in football you always i mean you always make new mistakes uh, you have to rectify them so i mean we are very happy with the way that we we played over the weekend i think we need to we'll just plan for one game uh see what we get see the number of points that we get uh then wait for the next one but uh the only thing that we can promise people is that we'll work very hard um we will i mean it's working hard it's showing the boys that uh, they they can do a, a lot of things without putting pressure on them like i said but uh what we can just do is just work hard and see what we get over the weekend um taking one game at a time and devin for them as players i think uh, uh it gives them confidence uh they i mean we signed them because we trust that they would be they would add value to the team and i think uh, they worked very well they they played very well on on saturday babalo defensively second half was very good when we needed him as our defensive midfielder uh botsani like you said gave us a goal olomu came in also and uh, played well for four minutes did what we expected him to do did what we told him to do lep ekola was fantastic for for the whole 90 minutes i mean you could say that it was difficult for duwodi to attack us on his side even the the old boys um, you talk about um uh uh Bonang who was very good everybody was good Busquets came in played very well showed what uh, um a substitute can do uh he made a difference when he came on to the pitch um uh who else Seiso played very well um all the new signings I think uh, I think they did us proud um uh, all the players did very well Tabo was solid in defense I mean the whole team this is going to be this is how we would like to see to 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 work um we need uh, the boys to understand that it's more important when we do it together uh, than doing it as individuals football like we always say is a team sport so we are very proud with the signings that uh, we we were able to to make and their performance was i think it was fantastic on saturday